Okay, so we're gonna show you how to do cheetah print accent wall. On the left is the cheetah print with paint in the center, or you could just do the stencil of the cheetah print alone if you don't want any paint. Basically, all you need is black paint, a pencil, and uh, whatever two or three colors you want to use in the center of the cheetah print to make the patterns. So, there's the paint. And you also are going to want a small sponge brush, like this, or a small painter's brush, just for the detail. So this is what it looks like close up. This one is one I just drew for you so that you can see what it looks like with just the stencil. Basically all it is is an odd shaped, um, like, figure eight, you could do a type of like odd triangle or whatever you you feel. Just like go freehand and just make it look weird because you don't want the patterns to match. Uh, for the cheetah print with the, that looks more like a circle, all you have to do is draw like a half circle and just kind of like weird shaped line and what you'll do is you'll paint in with the black this will make this shape and this will make something more like this so you just want to take the black paint and follow your stencil if it's easier, you could use a black marker or black crayon, pencil, colored pencil. I'm just using a, a regular pencil just because it's easier. To, in case I make a mistake, I could always erase it. But uh, cheetah print is not perfect. So it's easier for you to do it freehand and let, there, let it be a little messy. It's not going to be a big problem. So that's how it looks once you painted it in. And there you go. Now, if you want to do the paint like this in the center, all you need is a small sponge. You could use a makeup sponge, or what we did is we got one of these sponges from Home Depot, and you just cut them up into small pieces like this. And then what you do is just dip it into the paint and then you will press it in to the center. If you get some on the already dried black paint that's fine. You could just grab a piece of paper towel and wet it so you can wipe it down. You should be waiting till the black is dry or if you want you can paint the center with the color you want before you do the black so that the black can be painted on top of it in case there's any um, any bleeding from the color. But you want to wait till at least whichever one you choose dries first. And then that's how you do your cheetah print wall.